Well, starting off tonight, a closer look at overloaded animal shelters. According to the ASPCA, approximately six and a half million companion animals enter U.S. animal shelters each year, and about one and a half million are euthanized. Only four states in the country euthanize more animals than Alabama puts down every year. So WDHN's Cody Giles met with a local animal shelter to find out what can be done to reduce those numbers. Cody, what's the story? Well, Amanda, for a shelter to be considered a no-kill shelter, it has to euthanize fewer than 10% of the animals that come in, either for health reasons or if the animal is deemed dangerous. And even though Alabama had a decrease of 6,000 animal shelter euthanizations in 2020 as compared to 2019, it is still ranked fifth in the nation for animal shelter euthanizations. And I was able to speak with the Dothan City Animal Shelter to find out what's the best way to decrease these numbers. Take a look. Even though Alabama ranks fifth in the nation for euthanizing shelter animals, the Dothan City Animal Shelter is at a rate of only 3% euthanization. Our staff is very hardworking. They, they try, we try to think outside the box to try to save as many as we can save. The Dothan City Animal Shelter works with the local PetSmart as well as save a pet here in the city in order to keep their euthanization numbers low, but could also use your help in cutting these numbers down. The solution is community involvement in spay and neuter. Our shelter works very, very hard. We're very active. Our, our, um, we spay and neuter our animals before they're adopted. If pet owners aren't responsible, then the situation could get worse, which is exactly what the people of Dothan Animal Shelter are trying to avoid. And that's what we're all about, is to try to find this kitten a home instead of being euthanized. Any animal shelter, you need community help. You need, the, uh, you need your public to help you. You need your city officials to be behind you. You need your organizations to work together. According to the Best Friend Animal Society, in 2020, more than 101,000 animals were admitted into Alabama shelters, with more than 75,000 of those being saved, equating to about a 75% success rate. But with the help from the Humane Society and other places just like it, you can help save animals from having to experience that needle. And it may seem like a harsh way to put it, but the people at the Dothan Humane Society say that is the grim reality of overpopulation. If you would like to help, there will be a yard sale on Saturday at the Wiregrass Spay and Neuter Alliance on 570 South Foster Street right here in Dothan from 8 in the morning until noon. All proceeds will go straight towards spaying and neutering the shelter's animals. Back to you.